previously on. That the pickup line you settled on? Because maybe heard three in my life that were worse. And just a little, I thought. Wouldn't mind hearing them. Yeah. Happy to oblige. Ew, you swallow beautifully? That's nasty as fuck. You got two wishes left? I'll fuck you for free. What type of pickup lines are these? Rogue. I'm here on borrowed time in a borrowed body. But I'm here. Oh shit. Aww. Wow, it's a mess. Fugly as seafood barf. Hope it was expensive at least. Something's gotta justify this level of tacky. Okay, so we all know that Carrie is in that room because I searched everywhere and I don't see him in any other place. But the thing is, this door is locked, so... Wait, what's this? Eh, oh well. Something about Lizzy Lizzy. I mean, how am I supposed to unlock this door? This place is a mess too, honestly. And there's no way for me to get on it either. Wait a minute, wait a minute, hold on, hold on. Am I able to... go outside at least? At least his bodyguard hasn't noticed me yet. Wait, wait, let me see. Alright. I got a plan. I got a plan. I'm gonna walk around outside as well. See if I'm able to find anything. Wow, this is a beautiful view honestly if i had a house like this i would never leave never that was this people always say that after johnny vanished samurai vanished with him i'll push you one step further when samurai vanished so did carry eurodyne his latest album proves Eurodyne would never be more than a samurai epion on Arrow Bros, a sad second hand toward the farce. Eurodyne can't seem to climb out of Silverhand's shadow, and honestly, it doesn't seem like he wants to. He's still basking in the memories of decades old scandals because he just can't seem to put together a headline of his own these days. Kiri Yerodyne's golden age has long since passed. What's got me curious is how much money his label's pumping into the sinking ship, just so we don't think otherwise. Ouch! That really hurts. And that's the second album review, too. Um, so he's still making music, which is pretty fine. Unfortunately... Music fans. What's this? Second conflict. Carried always goes straight for kitsch with titles. Guess nothing's changed. Okay. Even I know that one. An oldie but a goodie. All right, so nothing to see here. 
Huh. Unsurprisingly, Samurai never achieved major commercial success because the voice that directed the group's trajectory was that of Demagogue frontman Silverhand rather than that of Eurodyne, whose main aspiration was the pursuit of music itself. Silverhand never possessed grand ambitions for creative expression. Instead, he was hell-bent on a personal path of devastation. These destructive tendencies had significant influence on Carey and persisted long after the Arasaka Tower attack and Johnny's disappearance. Only following an extended hiatus did Eurodyne prove to the world his, creation, his creative potential. He captured the imaginations and hearts of thousands of fans, securing him a spot in the company of music's legends. Okay, he's a certified rock star. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Oh shit. Oh shit. No! Chill! Oh damn. Oh damn. Oh damn! Okay. I am so not trying to get shot here. I should have never done that. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh! Woo! Okay, already they're shooting. Let me just, um, lock the door. Perfect. Now I really, really gotta find Carrie at this point. What the hell is this? Pretentious Bainty dunked in a sloppy symphonic source. Cryo Mac Rock Pretender at worst. Cockroacher at best. Okay, sure. Heavy riffs, check. Unique vocal growl, check. Essence of the 60s, check. But all of it gets drowned out in a flood of cliche dark tones that's too much for even neo tisk gen fans to swallow. There's no punch, no curb stump of edge. Honestly, by the standards of the genre, it's a fucking lullaby. I love to put this review to bed or in an unmarked grave, but I haven't even talked the lyrics. They made me roll my eyes so violently I sprained an optic nerve. Nor was it worse than in the titular track Liberum Artiburum, the band's anthem about the violations of human free will. What's the ignomic, ignomic evil depriving us of what matters most in life? Yep, you guessed it. Corpse. I yawned so loud I put the singer's growl to shame. The latest album from Tainted Overlord is nothing short of a chromatic rock mix you burned a decade ago. Erased from memory. Then found wedge under your couch next to a dusty Carlson's burger. Die hearts of the band will find something to scratch that itch. But anyone else looking for a fresh sound is better off blowing a con grenade in a cookware outlet what is up with these reviews okay first of all how am I supposed to find Carrie when all reality what's this Before Kerry Eurodyne became the rock god and American culture icon we know today, he was someone else entirely. Someone even he may not remember, or perhaps more precisely, would rather forget. In his samurai days, Eurodyne played second fiddle to the group's infamous vocalist, Johnny Silverhand. In his few moments of sincerity, such as the hard-to-find interview with Muriel Apold. Daskis. Eurodyne confessed that he left Samurai no less than two separate times, promising himself that each departure would be his last. While he variously claimed artistic differences, Silverhand's character, or 
organizational chaos as his reasons, the truth lay elsewhere. Simply put, the suffocating cramp clubs where Samurai played just didn't have a stage that could hold both Johnny and Carrie. Two inflated alpha male egos constantly vying for the mic and their fans' adoration. Yet Carrie always returned to the Samurai fold. Why? Here we enter the realm of pure rumor and gossip, the most interesting of which pegs Carrie's drama as the oldest, simplest story in the book. Love. What's this? Old single we put out. No idea why Carrie hoards shit like that. Love? Never fade away. Guess if I had a fave, it'd be that one. This is back in 2009. And that's 2007. Wow. This is crazy. Huh. It's like when I'm going through all of his stuff, I'm also discovering who Carrie is as well. Alone, too. Good thing, believe me. Okay, leave the rest to me. I'll get him out of there. Drop one of Misty's special pills. Let's go. Okay. Alright, here it goes. Damn. Feels so much better. Now let's see which are up for show and which are actually strummable. We lost everything. Oh, this is sick. Yeah, go off. Keep playing. All right. Johnny? Carrie? No. <laughs> no. no That's some fucking joke. Hang on. What did Silverhand tell me before he died? There's a test. Could just play you another song. Answer me. Told you to leave Samurai. Go your own way. Clearly I was right, as I often am. Johnny fucking Silverhand. Fuck. I mean, how? Surprise. Motherfucker! Wow, okay. That's a welcoming gift, I guess. Okay, weren't expecting me. I get it. Oh, fucking contraire. Been waiting 50 years to do that. So you changed a bit. Nice rack. Sporting a new style? Yeah, kinda. What about you? Shit. Johnny. Oh, man. I need a drink. Alright. Come on. Tell me. Why do you look like a small-time kleptopunk from the afterlife? This is V. You'd like her? The fuck, Johnny? Doesn't explain a thing. Nice place. Ain't seen much of it yet. Moved in after the fourth album came out. All sold well, apparently. Fuck you, Johnny. Don't even start. 
Who'd you sign with? Shit. With Arasaka. What? Mornings, I record at their studio. Then evenings, Yori pops over for a little neighborly cookout. Hmm. And who'd you really sign with? MSM Records. Another pillar of society. Come on. Sit down with me. Tell me where you've been all this time. Live here all by your lonesome? Nah, I've got my cook, Ariel, but he's off today. Miguel... What am I... Not your biz, June. Sit down. Start talking. Steal yourself for a long story. I just really want it to be tragic. Sad as all fuck over all those years. Cause if I hear you spent them with the nomads, open road, winning your hair, or cool and relaxed in orbit, and now you've just popped by to shit all over my life, well, I'ma lose my damn mind. Listen, judge for yourself. Oh, fuck, remember? The one damn time Henry showed up sober and clean as a whistle. Uh-huh. And played absolute tripe. At least Danny was happy. I like how they're just sitting here watching their own music videos, just reminiscing. And it seems like whatever I told Carrie, well, I'm still here, so... Who's that? Louise. The ex-wife. Ooh. The what? <laughs> You're kidding. How long did last? Eh, hey, too long. But don't worry. It worked out well. For her. Gave her my house in Tokyo. Cars. Kids. Kids? Yeah. Worked out pretty well for you too, then. Never did get what Denny saw in that guy. I mean, smart imp, that one. Maybe too smart for the company she kept. Nah, Denny always went for losers, incapable of dressing themselves. Oh, Hank was perfect. Half a brain and high all the time. She got to rescue him over and over again. Why'd she never try and fix me? Would have had to get in line, that's why. Looking at him now, those really were the best of times. Playing fucking rat-infested dumps. Argued before every gig. Had no idea what we wanted to play, and never had an Ed do our name. Nancy? Control freak. Henry smelled like zappers and piss. I was always stealing your pants. Hella good times, man. Stuff about you being depressed. It true? Nope. Promo stratagem. Suicide attempts, too? Think putting a bullet through your skull will help your sales? Damn. Didn't work for you. Nobody remembers Samurai. Now you're just butthurt because I managed fine without you. Fuck me. Got no answer to that. Still in touch with the gang? Just Nance. Changed her name to Bess Isis. Works for N54 News. Good. Track down Denny and Henry if you want. Maybe get together? You know, jam or something? Denny might still be in the biz. Actually had talent. And his spine. Yeah, released something not too long ago. Moved to North Oak, too. You just said you weren't in touch. Didn't hear from her. I don't think she might be avoiding me. You ever leave this house? Nope. I mean, I weren't either. This house is pretty dope. Henry probably killed his own liver. Nah, I would've heard if he was gone. Got mutual friends. A few calls and I should be able to track him down. Best Isis. Damn, Nance really went for it. Though all I hear is part-time stripper with a thing for ancient Egypt. Shame you died. Sure she would've welcomed your input. How is she in general, besides having nothing to do with music? Could ask her yourself. You wanna bring Samurai back? Nope. 
I don't know. Could do one gig, play some dive where nobody plays us. I mean, got my reputation to think about. But I won't have to explain what happened. All this? Nah, we'll spare him. Hell a boring story. Biochips, Arasaka's evil schemes, magic pills. We'll just say you're my new output. All right, let's do it. Fuck yeah! <laughs> Look at him, he's excited. Okay! Send you Nancy's number in a sec. I'll go after Henry and Denny. <sighs> I'm not there. Figure, Figure it out with V. Sure. Uh, you two get along? Not lately, no. We don't have much of a choice, though. How am I... Oh, shit. Johnny! You okay? No. Ah, so you must be V. Johnny mentioned something like this might happen. You two have fun at least? <laughs> that a hint of disapproval I hear? Just sit tight for a bit. Rest. Don't worry about a thing. Oh, you're so nice. The hell is this concert thing? Did you hear that? It's sharper as the pills wear off. So? Want to see Samurai live? Probably won't get another chance. What if this ends up like the rogue thing? One big letdown. Nah, this is different. Carrie needs this concert. Okay. Call in Nancy. Fuck yeah. Nice. Wow, okay. This should be interesting. Nancy, I mean, Bess, Bess Isis. No, this is her underpaid, underappreciated assistant. Steven, N54 News, how can I help? Wanna talk to Bess? She's not here. Calling from Carrie Uridine's residence. Cool. But Bess still isn't here. Okay. She was supposed to be back two days ago. Went to the Totentons to shoot some stuff, story on Maelstrom. Call back next week or just watch the news. If anything happens to her, I'll be the first to cover it. What the uh, hell? I think we better head to the Totentons. Yeah, you're telling me. This is suspicious as hell. How much you want to bet that she is in trouble? And I'll be there just in time to save her from being killed. Because it's pretty suspicious how she hasn't been there in over two days. And I just love how that finally loads to, like... I'll answer that text message later. I'm not in the mood. Fuck all starting to come together. No media would ever go for the tongue tents. Except Nancy. See? That confirms my suspicion. Let me see. What's this? Holy shit, Henry's on board. Way to go. Check out rehab of his own free will through the window. <laughs> Some nurse tried to stop us. At first, I thought she wanted an autograph. But she didn't even recognize me. Tell you the rest later. How's it going with Nancy? It's all under control. That's what I like to hear. This place is pretty... Quiet. Dark. Oh, Lord. All right. Like your style. Minimalist. Used to have chrome just like that. Um, uh, thank you. Start moving. Totem tents too. Fuck yeah. Third four. Hey, press the button. <laughs> oh, my fingers are numb. Uh. Come kay. on. Up you go.
I'm surprised this person's not attacking me. Then again, he's shit faced. Hear that? Tinnitus today. I guys. This one I like. That's cool. I'm glad you're enjoying yourself. Later. Okay, Go later. On. You'll blend in, no problem. Alright. Did Royce? No, 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 no. Wouldn't be that stupid to show up here. You the one? Looking for Bess Isis. Guess I gotta spell it out. You the one took out Royce. Yeah. What anyone actually boo-hoo when he went? Look at this. A chance at a nick in the barrel. Get the fuck out! Now! That's the All Foods punk. I'm not blind! What do you want? Watch out. Are you the one in charge now? Yeah! Puzzled! Never heard of you, Zol. You'll get your chance! Fess Isis. Mean anything to you? You work with her? No, just gotta talk. Heard she's here. Gotta talk. Sure. Yeah, that's why I said. I'll take you. Ha, <laughs> they didn't even shoot me. Oh my god, that shit is like a big ass way. To be rate. honest, should be thanking you. For what? Getting Royce out of the way was about time. Worked out pretty well for me, too. No problem, anytime. How ironic, and I thought I was gonna get shot. Okay. That's good, I guess. I love your hair, too. Maybe I should sell my hair like that. Wouldn't mind playing this venue. Of course you wouldn't, Johnny. You'll play anything that has a good stage. I already said I... Music media, yeah, you said. How about we mix it up? You tell- How in the fuck you search her, Tunda? That she still managed to call for help! Shit, that's Nance. Shh, did a number on her. Huh? I, I didn't call anyone, I don't even know her. But we do! And we won't have history repeating itself, damn it! Oh, fuck me, are you kidding me? Oh, 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 lord, okay. This is not good. And I'm pissed. Oh, shit. No! First of all, first of all, no, okay. First of all, this sucks. Hold on. Let me go <clears throat> and get <laughs> get my weapon here so I can... Let me see. Hold on. 449. 82. This one. Go. Let's go. Let's go. And what? And what? You thought you were doing something. Yeah. You thought you were doing something. Not on my watch. Come on, come on. Come on. There you go. There you go. And what? And what? Oh, and fuck. what? Thanks. Let's get her out of here. So, who are you? V. Carrie Uridine sent me. Carrie? Fuck, I do not get this. Uh-uh. Must have spent too much time with paranoid Patty in there. It's about samurai. Talk later, okay? Right. Let's Delta. Follow me. I'll get us out of here. I mean, Elevator. I'm gonna. Over there. Let's go. I'm gonna take all these stuff so I can sell later. So the fact that they were jumping me, fuck out of here. Ooh. All right. 
Oh no. Oh no. I'm leaving. No! Oh lord! I'm leaving! Cut it out! Leave me alone! Damn! I really got escape! This is horrible! Why is it oh. so damn slow in this dump? I know, right? This is horrible. Like That's rude. I'm not no gun. Oh, thank God. Cars outside. Okay, cool. You all right? Um, I've had better days. That gonquette was sure I was a goddamn spy. Damn, girl. We'll be all right. Hey, we'll be all right. How are you making Okay, movies? come on. Fuck. Just hope the car's still where I parked it. Why'd you come here? Really? Wanted to do a story on the music at the Totentans. No wonder Patricia didn't buy your story. Wow, everyone just jet. Okay. I'm glad we're safe. Kinda sucks how I died the first time, but whatever. Who's making that noise? Nancy, are you really making that noise? Okay, she is. Nancy, okay. Oh yeah, I get in the car. Okay. Oh, for fuck's sake! Ah, oh, could've been worse. That's why you got a souvenir. Fuck souvenirs. I'm headed straight back to the editing room. Wanna talk? Gotta come with me. Can't go like this. Hope it gets us there. One piece. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next time.